Chelsea and Elba. This comes to the side of Frederick Osmo. Right there, Sparks once again jumps up to the side. Massive angle from Chelsea and Elba in the chase position. Hunt them down. The Norwegian hammer gets sweated by Nadova. The winner is Chelsea Nadova. In the BC Racing Ditto Star 4 performance RTR Spec 5D. his second win in the 2021 season. He's found that BC Racing Ditto tire. Ford Performance Mustang RTR Spec 5D. Make some noise for Chelsea to know There you go. Head to head action, round five of the Formula Drift Pro Championship, Evergreen Speedway. We're ready to set it. So ever since James Dean came into the series, um, there was kind of a void left by a, just a driver that was absolutely dominant, right? A, a person that you expected to win every single event, that was on the podium every single event. That void has kind of been filled by Chelsea Denofa. Three wins, let alone three podiums in a season, is an amazing accomplishment. And it goes to show that he as a driver and himself, along with his team, are doing the right things and putting themselves in a position to win. So that is definitely a moment for me. Down into the power alley comes Chelsea Denofa. Odie Box is right there. Oh, does he allow? Look at it. Oh, we got contact. Definitely no. Nice yeah, job. He just got I was like, man, I hope they can see through that smoke a little. Because my car goes, ugh. Oh. The biggest moment, I mean, up until this point, we're only at round five, but we are at round five. Three wins. That's more than 50% winning average for Chelsea Denofa. He wins in Orlando, wins in PA, and wins here in the PNW. Dude, the dude doesn't even have to compete in a finals battle to get the win, both in Pennsylvania and here. Dude, is Chelsea gonna be the champ in 2021? You ready to get this thing? Here you go, third trophy here. Pilot the Nitto, the PC Racing, Nitto Tire, Four Performance, Western RTR, Spec 5D! It is Chelsea Donova! All right, gentlemen, go ahead. Everybody, hold your trophy up. Yeah, so uh, being here at uh, Evergreen Speedway, getting uh, the third first place of the season was, it's really awesome. Like, I can't believe it, that we're progressing this much. We definitely had some help with luck. Uh, I definitely won't deny that. Uh, but having a car that runs great uh, all the time and is able to keep up with everyone, like we are definitely a championship caliber team. And I'm definitely excited to keep pushing to be able to get that. Um, we're sitting first place in points right now after a win in, in Orlando uh, and Erie. Uh, so, I, you know, we keep this momentum going, get on the podium for the rest of the year, we can definitely take this home.